It's 7 a.m. This is Fox 40 Morning News. All right, well, this week we're featuring a three-part series on what to do if your computer crashes and you can't fix it. And we know just how frustrating it can be for you. So here, over the next three days, we're going to take you to the PC Pit Stop to show you different options you have for getting help. Now, today we're talking with Rescue Com, which provides itself in being able to get to your house or office within an hour for emergency repairs, pretty quick. And tomorrow we're going to be talking with the Geek Squad. You might remember them. They over have over 700 locations nationwide where an agent can come to your home or office to help or you can get help via the internet and then on Wednesday we're going to be talking with the president of Help Me Remote which is an internet repair service where you, know, you can give power of your computer to a repair person in another location who can then diagnose and fix problems and right now Nina is over with one of the te tech experts from rescue.com to give us tips on fixing your computer Hey, Nina. Hey, Nellie. Thank you so much. Joining us is Kim Westfall, who is a local franchise owner of RescueCom.com. He's here to talk about you guys ha are known for getting to someone's house within an hour to fix problems. Kind of talk about what um, this costs for people who want to give you guys a call. Okay. Uh, what we do is um, as soon as you call in and say, we've got a problem, we need you there right now, mm -hmm. then we put you on the top of the list, and I look around and see where all my guys are, figure who's the closest one, and say, get there. Okay. So what are the typical problems? What would I call you for if um, something's going on with my computer? That's up to you. If mm -hmm. you think it's an emergency, you give us a call. Uh -huh. Mainly if something's not working the way you want it and you're making money with your computer and it goes down, that's an emergency. That's They'll a big call deal. us. Okay, mm -hmm. so the number one problem you guys have is problems with Windows. What are it's either it doesn't start or it crashes? Kind of what are some ways that you guys fix that that people at home could use? Well, first, problems like that usually start with the simple fixes. Check the connections. Mm -hmm. Make sure everything's plugged in, that somebody hasn't tripped over a cord, pulled it out. And, and the next thing is turn it off. Start again. Now, wasn't there a procedure you're supposed to unplug everything, shut it down, wait a time? Kind of what's I've heard this. this um, what you do is you wait for the electronics to come down. Mm -hmm. uh, they're about 15 to 30 seconds okay. is probably a minimum. Okay. Do you have to unplug physically everything? No, just turn it off. Oh, just, just turn it off. off. Okay. And that should usually, once you restart it, it should fix the problem? It should. Okay. Most of the time it will. Okay, let's talk about hardware is the second uh, most popular problem with you guys. What is that? First of all, hardware is like the actual computer software is the applications and disks you install, right? Mm -hmm. uh, when we talk about hardware, not only do we mean the components that are inside the machine, the hard drive, but also the printers and any other thing now that you hook to your computer, mm -hmm. an iPod, a camera, anything like that uh, that you do hook up to the computer, we consider that hardware. Mm -hmm. And again, when you call in with a hardware problem, first thing you should do is check your connections. Mm -hmm. Read your manual. You know, most of the time the problem is you didn't read what you're supposed so to be long, doing. Though. I know. <laughs> this one doesn't act like that one uh -huh. or so forth. You know, my old camera did this. I pressed this, it did that. Your new one doesn't. Mm -hmm. Heck fire and so you give us a call. Okay. And then the third most popular problem is what? Internet connectivity? People can't get Can't on get that to the internet. internet. What's the deal there? Well, how do you fix that? Uh, again, check your connections. Mm -hmm. uh, after that, again, th what we suggest you do, you usually have a router or modem or something like that. Turn it off. Unplug mm -hmm. it. Start from the beginning. Mm -hmm. And most of the time, it'll bring it back up. Okay. Do you charge by the hour? How much does it cost? Yes, we charge by the hour. Um, we come out, but the clock doesn't start till we start working on your computer. Okay. Uh, we charge one hundred and eighteen dollars an hour. Okay. So that's for any problem under the sun, pretty much. Any problem under the sun includes Macintoshes, Apples. Macintosh, Apples, your printer, uh, your iPod, uh, whatever you have that plugs into your computer, okay. we'll do it. Hey, hey, Kim Westfall, thank you so much. RescueCom.com is the website, right? Yes, Get the it phone is. number, and it's 1-800-RESCUE-7. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. All right. Got it in my memory. Thank you so much, Kim. Thank you. And uh, hopefully we helped some people out. I learned some things. Just shut off the computer and check the connection. Just That's all you shut have to it do. off. <laughs> all right, Natalie, back to you.